We'll open the meeting of the Westbridge Water Assessors at uh, 610? Yes. 610 or so? Yes. And this meeting is being uh, taped by the Westbridge Water Community TV. Mr. Chairman, Mr. I, will, what do you got? I will read the mandatory statement regarding the state of emergency of Please. public access notice. Yep. Due to the public safety concerns regarding the COVID-19 pandemic, this meeting will be open to the public through remote participation only. The meeting will be accessible to the public by audio conferencing capabilities by telephone. If you would like to listen live, please dial 425-436-6392 and enter the access code 604-239 to join the telephone. Please be advised that the chairman may not allow questions from the listening public. Thank you. You're welcome. So, Mr. Chairman and board members, you know that you have a seven o'clock appointment this evening with the board of selectmen at the Council on Aging office for your fiscal year 21 tax classification hearing. Um, just a couple of quick announcements. A couple of days ago, we received from the Council on the Aging Director the list of all of the individuals who participated in the Senior Work Off Program for 2020, the hours that they worked, and the time uh, that they computed at the um, current, I think it's set by the state, compensatory rate. So okay. I will prepare a letter for the Board of Assessors to sign uh, telling the town accountant to deduct the total amount on the, the overlay account. Right. Yeah, very good, yeah. That's a real good program, you know. It were, um, it's worked out well over the years. There were 18 participants who completed 64 and a half hours for a total of $14,850 nine participants who are unable to complete the required hours due to the COVID-19 pandemic. Sure. <clears throat> which came to a total of $2,599.88 for a grand total for fiscal, or for actually calendar year 2020 of $17,449.88. The Plymouth County of Assessors Association will conduct its annual meeting on Thursday, December 3rd, it is a Zoom meeting, a okay. virtual meeting, for obvious reasons. I gave you each a copy of the registration form. If you would like to participate, please either let me know or the secretary of the association, Sherry Bates, by December 1st, and it gives her an email address. So okay. If you wish yep. to participate, or if you want me to fill out the information, just let me know and I'll do that. Very good. Uh, you have several applications for exemptions, payroll, and um, are there any, any motor vehicle exercise? Mm -hmm. And some motor vehicle exercise. Okay. So I, I think you signed already, Steve. So. Yeah. Uh, and because Cheryl's not here, I just want to make sure that we get these two signatures. Sure. Yeah, everything has two on it. There's something Cheryl had signed before, it looks like. Yeah. Okay, good. Yeah. good. yeah, she came in last week, I think, and signed some paperwork. Good. Well, we really don't have much to say on the COVID-19, except that it appears that the second wave may be you know, cresting. Uh, clearly, some communities are looking at maybe creating some more bed space. I think the city of Worcester is converting the uh, well, auditorium there. They're up against it, that's for sure. Into a uh, emergency COVID bed uh, facility. And we'll just see where it goes. I mean, I hope everybody has a, a happy Thanksgiving. It's probably going to be a Thanksgiving like no other because of COVID. I'm sure it's going to be small gatherings yeah. for most people. But other than that, uh, there's no direct effect on the office at this time. Okay. And I think. That's it for you. 
open session. I have a couple of quick things to go over in executive session. Okay. So if the board would entertain a motion to enter executive session for the purpose of reviewing applications for abatement and exemption and classification regarding the purpose, a relative to purpose seven, Master of the Laws, Chapter 59, Section 60, and to review and discuss strategy of pending appellate tax board cases relative to purposes three and seven of Master of the Laws, Chapter 59, Section 60, because to do so in open session could have a detrimental effect on the board's litigating position. Uh, position and to um, reconvene in open session at the Council of Aging Facilities for the purpose of the tax classification hearing. Very good, yep. Okay, um, at this time we'll make a motion for the board to uh, enter an executive session for the purposes that Mr. Doney just stated. And I'll um, make a motion and ask for a second. Second. All those in favor for the roll call, Assessor Bunker? Yes. McCarthy, yes. Yes. 